The Sun Awakens Just as the comet was putting on its show, the sun, which had been quiet for weeks, decided to join the party with its most powerful eruption in months. On September 28, at 0843 Universal Time, satellites from the GOES network detected a massive spike in X-ray emissions, jumping from a background level of 10 to the minus 6 to 6.4 times 10 to the minus 5 watts per square meter. An M6.4 class solar flare had erupted from a magnetically complex sunspot group, designated Active Region 4232, then rotating into view on the sun's southeastern limb. M class flares are the second strongest category, and a 6.4 is a significant event, powerful enough to cause radio blackouts on the sunlit side of Earth. Scientists at NOAA's Space Weather Prediction Center, like lead forecaster Dr. Alexei Pevtsov, immediately began analyzing data from the Solar Dynamics Observatory's AIA instrument at multiple wavelengths, including 131 angstroms, to assess the flare's power and, more importantly, what it threw into space. The energy release was equivalent to millions of hydrogen bombs detonating simultaneously. The timing was incredible. Just two days after the comet's own eruption, the sun had fired a warning shot into the exact same quadrant of space. 